you act from a very instinctive level. You can be quick, cunning and clever, and never seem to run out of ideas on how to make money. Your inner guidance is always leading you in the right direction. You're so intuitive in fact that you could become a professional psychic, if not early on in life, definitely later in life. You have the gift of gab and you are quite the salesperson. You are a master at the art of persuasion. You like to be surrounded by the arts and entertainment fields because they both supply you with your daily dose of creativity, which is greatly needed. You do have a tricky side, something other people get to see after they've known you for a while. You look at this part of yourself as being fun and entertaining. You don't really look or act your age, after all, being creative requires that you hold on to a certain amount of youth. When it comes to work, you would do well with sales, anything creative, and anything to do with large groups of people. As far as relationships go, you like variety, change and constant stimulation. You cherish your freedom and relationships can get in the way of that. You do require a certain amount of love and affection, but you have a difficult time making the necessary changes within to ground yourself long enough to commit. It's a real challenge, but if the right person comes along you can definitely master it. Others may see you as a player at times, but that's just your fun, creative nature showing off. You do like to play and have a lot of fun which can sometimes be difficult for others to manage. You are quite something. You sacrifice a lot for your family. You always seem to be caught in the middle of all of the family disputes, mainly because you are just the person to figure things out for them. You have a very balancing energy about you when it comes to family politics. And this seems to encompass finances, work, play, emotional entanglements and so on. In addition to all of this you have an artistic talent that can't be denied. You have a true appreciation for all things of beauty. You can also be connected with the healing arts on some levels. If you weren't so busy handling family situations, you could probably devote more time to various healing modalities. You have to walk a very thin line when it comes to giving too much of yourself for others, because this can sometimes lead to you giving too much of your time and energy, something you may not see returns to you equally. This can lead to you feeling taken advantage of. Always keep a healthy balance of how much you give others, and how much you take in. You are also very responsible when it comes to paying your debts. You like to be appreciated. The key to a successful life is to focus on your healing abilities. It'll help both you and others tremendously. Since you were born under the astrological sign of Gemini you can be inquisitive, affectionate, open-minded, perceptive, objective, clever and witty, eloquent, cheerful, kind, charming, versatile, savvy, imaginative, generous, inventive, adaptable and communicative, but you can also be restless, nervous and tense, fickle, two-faced, nosy, quickly bored, argumentative, manipulative and indecisive. Here are some suggestions on how you can bring positive change into your life, focus then commit. Follow through on everything, trust even when it's not easy. Look at the big picture, stop putting things off it's now or never for God's sake. Relax. Mind your own bloody business and for once in your life make a decision, and most importantly learn to love yourself and others unconditionally.